Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Sanders witnesses one of most powerful moments of her life as Trump meets wounded military hero. It was a perfect moment that was shared between President Donald Trump, Sarah Huckabee Sanders, John Kelly, and the many service members who are at the Walter Reed National Military Medical Center. President Trump spent time with many of the members, talking to them, awarding at least one young member a Purple Heart for being wounded in combat, and basically acknowledging the loyalty and bravery that the young soldiers exhibit towards America. It was a time that Sarah Sanders stated was one of the most powerful moments of her life as she watched the President of the United States award a young soldier with a Purple Heart. Sanders spoke of the strength and resilience exuded by the young men and women who dedicate their lives to protecting the freedom of ours. It's a time that seems to have spoken volumes as she watched people be given the respect and love that they deserve from the leader of the country. IJR reported more on the visit by President Trump and his administrative crew. On Thursday afternoon, President Donald Trump visited the wounded service members being treated at Walter Reed National Military Medical Center. White House Chief of Staff John Kelly accompanied him on the visit. During the trip, Trump spoke with the military members there. But there was one moment that stood out for White House Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders. Calling it one of the most powerful moments of her life, Sanders witnessed Trump award a wounded service member with the Purple Heart, the medal reserved for those injured in combat. Amazed by the strength and resilience of the men and women in our armed forces, she added. Trump is not the only member of his administration to visit troops in preparation for the Christmas season. Vice President Mike Pence visited and gave a speech to troops deployed in Afghanistan. Give yourselves a round of applause. We couldn't be more proud of every one of you, he told them. Secretary of Defense James Mattis is also on a trip visiting service members across the United States. He first stop was to talk with troops stationed at U.S. Navy base at Guantanamo Bay, Cuba. President Trump has time and time again displayed his gratitude for the American military. He constantly faces a barrage of criticism from those who oppose his leadership, yet he remains resilient just like the brave American soldiers are when they're faced with a hostile situation. President Trump has long been a great supporter of the armed forces, something that many critics say the former president may have lacked enthusiasm for. Honoring the members of the American military is a great honor, as they are the ones responsible for maintaining the level of freedom we endure today, and most notably, the elder retired veterans really played a true part in our ability to have this much freedom. It doesn't matter who the president is as long as the American troops get the honor, respect, and recognition they so much deserve. The brave people who are willing to fight, defend, and protect America and its core values and freedom are some of the most notable people in this great country. The only problem with the military is that the veterans should be treated much better than what they sometimes report. The Veterans Affairs appears to consistently receive complaints about the conditions of their facilities and the treatment of their patients. There are people who go into full combat for this country, deployed away from their families and fighting in hostile war zones, then come home and are treated poorly. The level of care for military veterans needs to be increased because its current treatment is seemingly unacceptable. Anyone can search for many of the numerous cases of poor conditions or mistreatment or lack of quality treatment that American veterans receive. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.